Hi, and welcome to Unlimited 3D. In this video, we'll be showing you how you can use our platform to set up a configurable 3D model that allows for parts on it to be changed. In order to create a configurator that allows for parts and not only materials to be configured, on the platform, you need to set up a model which contains all of the parts that will allow for mutual switching between them. Essentially, the 3D solution should contain all possible parts that will be needed for the configuration. Once the model is published, during the initial load, we want the start scene to showcase only the initial desired configuration, and the rest to be hidden. In order to set up the start scene, within the mesh of the model, you need to hide the parts which will not be shown during the initial load. On the platform, within the start scene, create all options regarding the scene and the model which is to be default. Once the model is set up, you can proceed to integration. Here is a working ring configurator that allows for the stone on top to be configured. After you've copied the API code, find the following functions within the code that will be called upon the need for configuration. CHG Stone 1, CHG Stone 2, and CHG Stone 3 are the functions that will change the shape of the stone. Within them, call the API functions from the Unlimited 3D API library. These are called Hide Parts and Show Parts. The idea is to hide the parts that are no longer needed and then show the ones that are. The documentation for this API library function can be found in our API documentation. We hope we've been able to explain the basic logic behind setting up configurable parts. May you have any questions, please feel free to drop a comment below or to ask away in our community center. Thanks for watching. We're looking forward to having you as a part of our community.